Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Guys, I don't review many rackets like this anymore because not many manufacturers are making them like this anymore. Stay tuned. All right, coffee sponsor of today is Shay, S-H-A-Y. Shay writes, love your videos. From rackets reviews to advices on loosening your grip to prevent injuries, keep it up. Oh, thank you, Shay. Um, appreciate the kind words, appreciate the coffee, um, appreciate you. <laughs> thank you so, so much. If you wanna be my coffee sponsor of the day, like Shay, Network is buymeacoffee.com forward slash tennis spin. You want to just contribute to the channel. Super thanks is the way. Link is below. Thank you so, so much. All right, guys. Um, in the past, I want to say two, three years, we haven't reviewed a lot of these types of rackets because a lot of the manufacturers have limited their production of them. Um, and I can talk about why uh, in a minute, but you know, rackets like this, which is the Yonex Astral, the newer one in the 115, right? A lot of manufacturers have kind of, you know, either kept with what they have uh, or what they had uh, and stop making new variations of them um, and stop kind of spending the time and the resources to develop new ones. Um, I feel like they've kind of seen, you know, the end of the tunnel and, and it doesn't include large rackets anymore. It's kind of a shame because there still is a market for it. Um, I feel like a lot of this generation has gone to um, pickleball. <laughs> I think pickleball is one of the main culprits of why these guys aren't um, playing as much tennis as they were. Um, they've gone to a different sport. They've socialized different through pickleball. Um, but a racket like this, you know, we used to see a lot of this stuff. And this racket is one of the few left that provides power, is light, gives you actually good spin. I mean, it's 9.7 ounces strong, 16 by 17 string pattern. Look at how big those squares are. That's going to give you a lot of spin with the head size being one one five, one fifteen square inches. The interesting thing about this racket is it's actually a quarter of an inch shorter. It's not 27. It's 26.75. Look at that. It's a lot of head, little throat, and then your handle. So racket ball-ish type of a look. They have technology in here that helps dampen the shock. So not only are you getting power, you don't have to worry about tennis elbow. Huh. Now, most of the time we string these, I would say 90 something percent of the time, we string these with a multi. Um, their tension recommendation on this is interesting. It says 40 to 55. So at that range, it's geared more towards power. <laughs> Hey guys, do you need a tennis buddy? Want some more tennis friends? Have you guys considered play your court? You can find over 27,000 players out there, coaches and playing partners. That's playercourt.com forward slash tennis spin. Made in Japan, balance is 340 before string, so it's got good head weight. That's also helping you prevent tennis 
elbow. Now, most of the time we string it with a multi, like I said, something like a Vanquish, which I did with this one, at 52 pounds. I wanted to go just a little above mid just to keep it under control. They do give this an RA of 68, which is a little surprising to me of how thick this is because this cross section is actually really, really thick, like especially right there. I believe it's 28 millimeters, 27 up here, and then it tapers down to about 25 there, which means it's stiff, stiff, like really stiff, and then it flexes right here. So this is probably where that 68 is coming from in that throat area. All right, let's go test it out and see if there's shock, see if there's power, and see if there's good feel all right and actually test how stiff this thing is especially with the new strings all right we'll see you on the court Just got off the court, Astro 115. I think it's time for me to switch to something like this. I, I don't know. Maybe it's today, but... Um... You switch, I switch friends. <laughs> <laughs> see, see, this is why people don't want to go into the big rackets, because they're a little embarrassed, because everybody's going to make fun of them, even though you play well with it. You know, all you TIS 6 users, I praise you, because you're sticking to your guns and you're playing with what you feel that's right for you and that works for you okay you stick to your guns all right coach rob yes okay um astro 115 right 115 square inches very very light racket very big pretty heavy in the head yeah look look at that surface area yeah. versus throat versus grip right surface area is way bigger than these two absolutely what did you think give me that <laughs> so um it felt okay. I hit a couple nice slice serves with it. Some ground strokes were okay. Um, the weight, I was surprising it wasn't super light. I thought with it being a 115 that it would have been really light. Um, but it it may be light in the specs, but it didn't play light. It felt like there was some weight in the head. And um, yeah, it was, you know, it was good to look into what I'd be playing with in the next, you know, 30, 40 years um, of something of this head size. 50 years. Uh, I'm not sure I'm be around. if I'm playing, <laughs> I'm not planning on being 150. So, <laughs> but it, it had very hammer-like right. characteristics, right? Because you, when you first hit, it's been with, a while since I use a hammer, but well, I remember we're dating ourselves, obviously. Yeah. But when you when you hit the first few shots, you're like, this feels kind of familiar, and and I yelled out, I was like, remember hammer? Or right. Remember profile? The profile. I was like, oh yeah, that's <laughs> it. Well, profile was the original heavy, and then hammer lighted it up. So this is kind of in that, you know, realm. Right. Um, but no, I'm glad they're. You know, some companies don't seem to be making rackets of this size, mm -hmm. and you know, uh, players that are, you know, uh, of later, late in their later years, you know, that want to keep playing and aren't switching to that other. Uh, you know, paddle um, game that uh, people are playing a lot now that start with a pickle. You mean um, the one that's uh, supposed to be in your burger? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, that would be something, you know, it's nice that they still have this and hopefully it will still be a popular selling racket for players that are want to keep going in yeah. their tennis and not making the shift. Yeah, so what did you feel? Obviously you felt power. You said you felt the... Uh, the weight felt, in the head coming through. Felt some of that, uh, like the slice, there's lots of string surface to rub the ball across. Mm -hmm. I think I might even slid one past you that yeah. wasn't intentional by any means, but... Um, Look at how big the squares are. Right. There are there's not a lot of, of strings there. Right. So, and just how much you can... Oh, it's yeah. a lot of rip. It's moving. Right. It's snapping. So your slice gets deadlier. Right. Right. The, the, the kick serve gets higher. You know, so... 
if you flatten it out with the strings spread out that way, you actually get more power because it gives a little bit more. Right. So I actually, I mean, I, I was semi-serious saying that I would uh, me, switch me to too. something like that. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no, I pleasantly surprised when you hold it like this, obviously it feels light. When you hold it like this, you definitely feel the head weight. And there's a lot of plow, a lot of head weight, and it's all kind of concentrated at the top. So it actually helps you, you know, finish up when you get it started. So if you can get back, get through, if you want to hit it flat, totally fine. It'll give you the power. If you want to come up a little bit, these strings will move and snap, right? This Vanquish was actually super comfortable in this racket. Definitely recommend a string, this string, uh, for this racket. Uh, multi, super soft, will give you the return of energy that it absorbs. Uh, I actually dug a volley out and actually went over to the other side. And then I put the next one away, thanks to Coach Rob making me look good. Uh, but uh, definitely recommend it, guys. If you need just a little bit of help, maybe a hair more than a little, um, try the Astro 115. There aren't many of these around anymore in, in this head size, and I consider this one of the best, if not the best in the market. All right. Coach Rob, thank you. Sure. For, uh, you know, testing Looking out. into the future. Yeah. <laughs> this might be my current future. <laughs> not, nice knowing you. <laughs> oh, well. Anybody want to be my partner out there? <laughs> Maybe we can both play with this. <laughs> Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.